Hi, this is Susan of Inner Wisdom Healing Arts. This is Lesson 99 in A Course in Miracles. It is salvation is my only function. Now, I want to start by talking about the word salvation because my first reaction is um, discomfort to the word salvation. I, I didn't grow up um, religious and to me salvation is such a religious word but as I studied the lesson salvation was equated with forgiveness that salvation equals forgiveness and that felt better for me so for me to be able to say forgiveness is my only function feels so much more comfortable so I'm just throwing that out there because sometimes there are um, there are certain words. I mean, even you know, saying God versus source or the divine, um, you know, really push our buttons in different ways. What we're doing today is releasing the illusions in order to heal the mind of fear. Forgiveness is my only function. This reminds me of a hypnosis session I did very recently in which the client experienced a forgiveness ritual under hypnosis. The Divine Mother came in to assist her with this ritual. Um, For many, many years, she just struggled with a relationship. One of the tools the Divine Mother gave her was to say namaste. This person was showing up in her dreams. So she told her, when this person shows up again, say namaste. And it makes so much sense. I look at this lesson and I go, of course, because namaste is one soul is recognizing the divine within another soul. And that is forgiveness. It's it's moving beyond the ego. And that's exactly what we're doing here. We're releasing the illusions. What this lesson tells us is there is only love. Everything else is an illusion. There is only love. So we could say, namaste. That's right. We recognize the truth within everyone. We're connected to everyone and everything. We're moving into a state of non-duality. That's what we're practicing. So you literally could take this lesson and throughout your day acknowledge the divine within everyone would be a wonderful way to do today's lesson. And also meditate on it and see How does that feel when you sit with that? I know for me, I really experienced it in my third chakra, right? This is third chakra being, how do I feel about myself? Forgiveness, can I forgive myself? Just be present. Accept that source's will for you, source's desire for you, is happiness and peace, not a world of pain and destruction and suffering. That might feel really hard to believe. And often we're keeping ourselves in that cycle because of self-punishment. Can you forgive yourself? Can you believe and accept that there is only love here for you. There's nothing to fear. Only love is real. Invite yourself to release any guilt and all thoughts of deserving punishment and pain. Can you accept that you deserve the peace and happiness? You are a divine being. Invite source to shine through you, helping you to see 
the truth of love everywhere within yourself and extending that love to all. We're all one, one light. Thank you for joining me on this journey.